Hello, welcome or welcome back beautiful people to all my subscribers and visitors. I would love to thank you because you guys motivates me to do what I love and enjoy. If you are new here, my name is Aisa. I do feature handbags and a bit of style once in a while and I'm doing this for fun. So if you're just here to watch the video, I want to thank you. But if you want to support my channel, then feel free to like, share and subscribe. Today, I'm going to do an unboxing video for you guys. Well, technically it is not unboxing because I've already opened the box. I couldn't wait to see the bag. So this is a reveal and it is my first ever bag from this brand and if you have watched my 2024 wishlist video you can probably guess uh, which bag I'm going to show you guys and if you are familiar with this dust bag there's no label at all no label nothing you can probably guess by now all right let's reveal I find that the dust bag is a bit too small for this bag. I don't know why they have to use a small dust bag. But anyhow, stop complaining, Isa. Okay, it's time to reveal. Time to reveal. Okay, do we need a drum roll? Da 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 da! Da da! I know, guys. I know, I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know. Look how pretty and beautiful or gorgeous this bag is. Just, oh! my goodness me the moment i opened the box and first time seeing the bag i'm like oh my goodness me <sighs> almost speechless anyway this bag is from terry birch as you can see the logo on top of it and the bag is called the fleming convertible shoulder bag i have purchased this bag from Furfetch. If you haven't heard about Furfetch, I'm going to put the link on the description box um, just in case you are interested. They have heaps of brands that you can find. Name it from luxury brands to contemporary brands. And they always have uh, promo deals on sale just quite often. So if you're interested, visit their website. This is not sponsored by the way. I'm just trying to help in case you're interested upon searching Tory Birch brand I have read that all their authentic products such as bags um, shoes are all made in China I think their factory is in China so please let me know and so again this is the Tory Birch Fleming convertible shoulder bag the size is 27 centimeters in length 17 centimeters in height and 9 centimeters in depth um, based on the website, the bag is made of 100% calf leather. Please let me know if this bag is supposed to be made of Napa leather because I am new to Tory Birch. This brand is new to me, so I'm not sure. And um, the side is made of suede, both sides. That's how it looks at the front, the top with the Tory Birch logo and that's the bottom and the back it has no back pocket and the chain says it's 30 centimeters drop it's a shoulder bag i guess and so you can double this up like this to use it as a shoulder bag and i love the length because it is not too close to your armpit and plenty of space it's just very 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 comfortable i must say and i have tried this on using the crossbody strap i find it very very long and very big boxy it's not for me it's not for me so i am gonna use this bag as a shoulder bag because the name is shoulder bag <laughs> and so yeah, the weight of the chain, I'm, I would say it's not too heavy, not too light though. Uh, I would say the quality is not bad. <laughs> I'm just going to show you closely the chain. So that's how it looks like. And obviously it is not detachable. So you can just double this up like this or pull it up like this okay now let's go to the interior part of the bag but before that i want to show you something and hear this one because this is my favorite part 
Okay, let's open the bag and feel this one. <gasps> did you hear that, guys? Did you hear that? Oh my goodness me, one more time. One more time. Oh my goodness me. I am obsessed. I am obsessed with that magnetic mechanism. It's so strong and it's so satisfying and it's so easy to close the bag without even trying. Anyway, <laughs> let's go into the bag. So let's open it. The interior flap is made of leather and that's the magnetic mechanism there and the one down here with a Terry Birch engraved on the hardware and let's take out all the papers so we can see the inside of the bag so the interior is made of fabric and there are three compartments one in the back the middle compartment and the front compartment and a zipper uh, compartment there and there's a Tory Burch logo engraved on the hardware there as well and yeah just look and imagine how big or spacious the compartment is. this bag is actually a lot bigger than i expected which is great that means i can put extra essentials in this bag okay so i am going to put something inside the bag so we can all have an idea what fits in this bag and also i'm going to do a mod shots towards the end of the video so i appreciate if you guys stay till the end of the video so thank you in advance okay let's start putting things in this bag i have this umbrella i carry umbrella with me during the summer because it's really hot here in australia so let's put this one in the middle compartment and i have these Zip card case, wallet, zip card case, wallet in there. And I have the, what's this? My first aid pouch, um, my sunnies. I don't know if I'm organizing it properly. Let me just reorganize it. I'm not really good at organizing, honestly. I am. <laughs> Let me just. Okay. So there, there you have it. It's more organized. <laughs> and I have the. My. What's this? My pills. <laughs> oh my god. Can't even talk. And my headphone. I can probably put it in the front compartment. Um, and I have the phone. Let's put this as well in the middle compartment. And what else? Um, the lipstick and lip balm. Where can I put? Okay. Sorry, guys. Okay. And now let's shut. Let's close the bag. Let's see if it's going to be easy. Okay. Um, it shuts, but I was expecting it to shut or close by itself, like what we've seen earlier. But of course, the bag was empty earlier, so we cannot compare. And that's how it looks with things inside. Do you think it's bulky? Do you think? I don't think it's okay. I think it's all right. Um... So yeah, there you go. You can actually put on, I'm pretty sure you can put a regular size water bottle as well. Oh, I love this one. Oh my goodness me. I am in love, guys. I am in love. I am going to show you now a bit of mod sets. So stay tuned.
right, that's about it, guys. Thank you for staying with me. And if you have any questions, just leave a comment down below. But again, I am not a professional bag reviewer nor an expert. I can only try my best. But I have a huge favor to everyone to please be nice and kind and polite and friendly at the comment section. Please, please, please. And so, yeah, that's it. Thank you, everyone. Have a lovely weekend wherever you are. Be good, be safe, be kind. Bye.